Yeah. You see what happened to this guy? Okay. I do have options here. Should we do it? Fuck! I was trying to slip him. Ninety nine. We got off pretty easy with one hit there. Uh, I'll take a caution. That's fine. Woohoo! For fucking sick. Oh right. Is that problem sorted? Oh, I thought so. Just the one? Just the one. Get the fuck off me. They can't grab you unless they're lying on their front, I've noticed. Oh my god, you see? So... <laughs> Get fucked on. The music ain't stopped. Now nah, I heard that. I did hear that. That was pretty consistent. There is one here. Sorry, I heard some other noises somewhere. Oh, not this again. Oh, all the buttons might be there. Bet they're not, but... Oh, I could do 105, 109. What? No! Was it 106? Then I do 105 instead of 106. I did. I did it twice in a row, in fact. Come to pub. Daddy? The fuck do I need that for? Alright, well. That's all we can really get for now. Ah, into the bin. Oh, that's what I need that for, of course. That, yeah, that's the evidence thing. Do we have to find the other buttons? No, we don't. That's good to know. There will be no button hunting. Alright. We're still good. Gonna keep the rifle out, because... Oh. what you get mate it's what you get <laughs> he put up such a good fight too why is it saving again Carlos, I did a dead end with the terminal here gotta head your way copy that be careful Cause that won't piss them off. Oh my good god. Oh my double good god. Okay. What? Oh shit! Fuck! Okay. Thanks for. St oh, fu fuck! How many are back here? <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, come on! Jesus. 
Ah, oh, shit. Wait. Oh, he has a shove. That's where the shove is. Okay, okay, good to know. God damn. There's like seven in there. Another place that flash can be used then. You know what? One shot, maybe? Damn! <laughs> Fucking hell. You and me, fat man. Woohoo! It's not a good noise. That was intense! Doc, you're in here. Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Do you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. Now, negative. RPD's overrun, too. Then figure it out! Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send, send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. Interesting. I like him already. Right? <laughs> yeah, you would. You heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. That's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. Alright. Oh. This will take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. Classic. Rebecca's bag. And the Made in Heaven uh, Chris's jacket. Uh, let's put that away. Ooh. Okay. Wesker's office. Is that Jill in the front row? It sure is. Report on the mansion incident. This bizarre incident uh, occurred in a mansion owned by the Umbrella Corporation located in the Arkley Mountains on July 23rd. Stars Bravo team was dispatched to the Arkley Mountains to investigate a series. Wasn't it the 22nd? Investigate uh, mysterious and grisly murders and went unexpectedly radio silent on July 24th. Alpha Team was dispatched as well. All oh, right, that's it. Yeah, yeah, Alpha Team. And became entangled in the events of the nearby mansion. The incident culminated in the destruction of the mansion. Casualties were numerous. The only survivors were five members of STARS. The cause of the incident was the illegal bioweapon experiments being carried out by uh, out in a secret umbrella lab beneath the mansion. The T-Virus being used in these experiments escaped the facility and is presumed to be the root uh, cause of all the incidents. To be the root cause of all that occurred. However, all evidence was destroyed along with the mansion, so further investigation has proven to be extremely difficult. That's a bit of a rip. Ooh. Now I know. Ooh. Mate, if you just don't get Brad's card. It's definitely doable without that. That's a lot of bullets, so. Alright, <laughs> uh, so Finn. How long are you actually going to need? Oh, well, get to put that in the bin now. I assume just when I try to leave. There we go, yeah. Yeah, what's up? Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Jill? 
What? Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! T, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bart. Yeah, we'll see about that. That's fucking funny. <laughs> Jill's like, ouch! And he's like, I'm on my way! That's yes, alright, I got new orders. I gotta stay here. That's what he said before. And now he's like, ah, oh, fuck the orders. Gotta save Jill. <laughs> Am I the only one who made it? Yes, there was only you three. <sighs> Nemesis made sure of the survivors immediately. Which is kind of upsetting. Oh, I guess she's fine now. <laughs> Carlos? Come in. Carlos? Damn it. I guess I'm out of range. Oh, I saved my inventory. Solid. New weaponry notice. Good news, limp dicks. I've got some new weaponry for you that's guaranteed to put the brass back in your sacks. <laughs> They're called mine rounds. These babies were developed in Umbrella's military R&D and they will light your fires even hotter than the lover you left back home. They're tough to find and tricky to handle, but trust me, they're worth it. Alright, let's take a look at the specs. Mine rounds are designed for standard issue grenade launchers. Don't get cute and try to load them in anything else. Fire them at walls and on the ground. They'll stay right where you put them. The sensor in the mine will detect approaching enemies and detonate when they get within range. So basically just toss them in an enemy's path and you got yourself a landmine. No such thing as unfair when you're taking on these giant freaks. So get out there and fight dirty. Gotta agree. Gotta agree. So why are they fucking blue? That fucking puts me off immediately. I ain't even got the launcher on me so I don't need that. Uh... Shove that in the bin. Shove that in the bin. You never know when Nemesis shows up, so let's do a bit of organizing here. Feels very unsanitary in here. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa hey. <laughs> so, wait, who left that there then? Was fucking Nikolai like, yeah, in case you make it, kid. I'll leave some mine rounds back here for you. I've only got four rounds, shit. Oh man. Okay, we were really supposed to use one here. I've got quite a whole way to work with, this is fine. This is fine. Let's be quick about it though. Take them out, take them out, yeah, swap them in, combine them in, stick them in the shit. Oh. You can't eject the ammo from it. Well, okay. I thought one was my shotgun. That's depressing as fuck. Fuck off. Double fuck off. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. fucking funny guy, ain't you? Uh. God damn. Didn't need it. I do, however, really need some. Ooh. I need some fucking handgun bullets. Which we do have. We have a couple of. What can we get out of this? A whole 15. Oh dear. <laughs> this isn't going to get me very far. I guess that one starved to death right as we arrived. Hello. Oh, 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 okay. Fuck, fuck. This is why we have no bullets, Jill. Uh. 
Yeah. Didn't figure that shit, did you? Yeah, I didn't think so either. I believe that one to be dead though, because I blew his fucking brain off. <laughs> Can I have ammo, please? Not like crazy, just just a few. Hey, Carly, how you doing? Walker's still alive. I can't stay here. Yeah, you no shit. Escape the creature, no. Not now, Nemesis! Come on! Hang on, I got time to read this though. Clock Tower brochure. St. Michael's Clock Tower is a, whatever that says, style building with, which stands at the heart of Raccoon City. It's become a beloved icon and residents consider it to be emblematic of the city as a whole. St. Michael's Church erected this tower in, 19, in 1908 with the assistance of several philanthropists, naturally. It was dedicated to the children born in the developing city as the first floor was used as an elementary school for many years. The city saw further growth during its electrification over the course of the early 20th century and the students... Uh, the student body of St. Michael's Elementary swelled to over 600 students. Unfortunately, St. Michael's Elementary was shuttered in 1978 as the beginning began to show signs of AIDS and where uh, the clock was deactivated and strict limitations were placed on entry to the surrounding premises. Years passed with this once beloved monument and public plaza on lockdown. But in the 1990s, the American Corporation worked in league with Mayor Michael Warren to renovate and reopen the area. This time, with proper preservation efforts in place, the clock tower was officially reopened in 1993, and today, the sound of its heavy tolling bells can be heard once again throughout Raccoon City. I missed something. Thank you. Definitely in need. It's 3.23 a.m. Standard. Sounds like someone needs to go to sleepy time junction. Giz. Mix and match that crap. I thought I heard that. Little fucker. Trying to hide from me. On the creepy old city streets. This place is amazing. That's a normal model. He's fine. He's just pretending, I think. I think he, he can avoid the apocalypse if he just pretends to be dead. This is... Why was he on fire? I think he can, mate. Carlos, respond. <clears throat> yeah, what's up? We didn't make it. The train derailed. Everybody's dead. Mihail, everybody. Oh, shit. Nikolai left us to die. Wait, what? What the fuck? It's back! Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! Um! Ah! <laughs> Don't like it! Yeah, that'll stop it. Come on, Jill. Oh, shit. Go back. <laughs> Ooh. Dodge mechanics. Oh. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, okay. Would you want one of those? Yeah, I thought so. That makes it feel better, don't it? Fuck me, what do I do? It's a fucking big old boss arena. Yeah? Doing a bit of a yell. I appreciate that. Woohoo! Oh, I don't like that. Don't do that. How do you feel about that, though? Does that feel good? You like that? <laughs> His transformation! What is this creature? Oh, no, I gotta reload. Ah! Why is it so zoomed in? Let me see. What is this? Oh boy. Oh, that's almost my first hit. Ah!
Whoa, whoa, wait a minute, where's he going? Really? Any idea on what he's doing? Why'd you let him go that far? Are you kidding me? Uh, I'm running out of fucking bullets. Yeah. Okay, okay. Do some more of that. I get it. You gotta get your aerobics in. Get that cardio. Nah, fuck that. Let him do it. Is he? No, he's not. Excellent. Right, I need, I need all of this. Oh, oh no. Uh, not really anywhere to hide here. That's rigged. It's rigged. Oh, fuck. What? What do you expect me to do? You got any fucking tips, Jill? He d I can't even hit him! Thought you had me there, didn't you? How am I hitting just the post? I'm awfully confused. This fucker is fast. Yeah. Oh, well done, Jill. I literally have nothing. Pretty sick. <laughs> I don't know how he missed. I've run out of bullets. Oh, that was lucky. That's like my last one. Let's do this. Where'd you get that from? Stop it. <laughs> Carlos, you still there? I got a bot. <laughs> oh, solid. Oh, that's great. I love these guys. It's a really good idea the way you've done insert title. It's terrible code as well because there's no context. These bots really need to step up their game. I am surprised we even survived that. I had one shell left. Oh my days. Ah. Uh, more mine rounds? Is that what you... I need to stop it in its tracks. Mine rounds. I get it. Fucking risky movie. Could have just split you in half. Ha <laughs> 
The portcullis! Yes! Oh my god. Why is he here? 